What you doing there, Brad? I'm clearing my runway. Cause I'm gonna set a watermelon up there in a little bit and I'm gonna take this uh, sword that we just worked on and I'm gonna take a swing at it and I'm gonna whack the watermelon in two. So, let's see. We got an orange to work on later. Let's work on, uh, let's cut some paper. See how that works. If you want to know what kind of paper it is exactly, go find Rooster. Rooster Magazine, I guess. Uh, and, and, and Mint? Oh, never mind. Uh, music? <laughs> They've got it covered up. I don't have any idea what. Uh, what that's supposed to be, the people who buy it know what it is, all right? <laughs> if they hide most of the words, it's going to be hard to figure out what the word is. Anyway, this is the one that I just sharpened on the rocks a little while ago. And let's see. That's really not too bad. Okay, we'll do it one more time. All right. I'm going to work on the uh, cutting edge just a little bit more with my little round sharpener. See if I can't finesse just a little bit better edge on it. Just like that. sword's still a little thick. I actually bought the watermelon. I was going to take my little four inch grinder and really put an edge on it. But let's do it this way. Then I'll probably, when we get home, use my four inch grinder, put a better edge on it, buy another watermelon, and whack that one. All right, let's see. Cut the paper one more time. The wind is messing with me. That's pretty good, actually. All right. Let's take a watermelon here. I found an old Copenhagen can. that flat spot will help it stay up there, set up there. Something like that. I think I'm going to stand up here. Let me down there. Alright, let's see. I'm going to stand him up. Kind of an angle. Whack him right in two. We'll see if I can even hit where I want to. top off of him. Actually that's pretty clean. Almost got him off of there without falling. Definitely slicing off pieces. <laughs> this Brad goofing off having a time. Dropped it right down, dropped it on the post. That's pretty clean. I'm going to sharpen a little bit more to make them really clean. This Brad, sharpensbest.com. And boy, that is a juicy watermelon. It's 
getting a little bit soft, but boy, is it good. This is Brad Buckner, Sharpers Best.com. You take care. Have a good day.